My next guest is an Emmy and Golden Globe nominated actor who stars as Schmidt on New Girl. Please welcome Max Greenfield. <laughs> Max, uh, good to see you again. Sure. <laughs> Thank you for bringing the cheesecake. <laughs> mm -hmm. Steven, I really did it this time. Why, did you win the Tour de France? Why do you have uh, a yellow jersey on? What, what have you done? It's a lot of leg there. I apologize yeah. for that. Those are called, those are, those are. <laughs> you know what color that is? Fire engine pale. <laughs> I have become officially a youth soccer referee. Okay. Thank you. All right. You know what? It's quite an achievement. Quite Thank achievement. you very much for that because I've been getting booed so much lately. And why did you do this, Max? Well, it's interesting. We'll find out. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> so, as it turns out, yeah? not a lot of not a lot of people want to be the referee. And you wouldn't believe how much work goes into being a youth soccer referee. No, oh, it's a thankless job. Yeah, well, you know, I had to take all these online courses. Yeah. And then I had to drive out to Redondo Beach, which is like the equivalent of you driving out to, yeah, sure, to Queens. Right. And I took this four-hour seminar, at the end of which there you was... Have to you have to, like... Well, have there to was an exam at the end Is there, end like, a rule book and everything like that? Uh, yeah, well, I skimmed through it. There is an exam <laughs> at yeah. the end, yeah. and I was positive that I had failed the exam. I was so sure that I had failed, but to everyone's surprise, including myself, I somehow passed. And I'm like, I, I, I honestly, not only did I pass, do you, have way, a do you have a child, by I the way? I do. Not only did I pass, though. Is this for your child's team? It is. I couldn't have done better on the test. And I'm watching the results come in, and I'm thinking to myself, I can't believe this. <laughs> So you never thought you'd actually end up being no, the referee? It was, it was a fun bit at first. You know, my daughter got really excited about it. She plays for the Purple Pythons. Uh -huh. And... Uh -huh. Yeah, right on. Yeah, sure. She got excited. Yeah. And then my family got excited about it. Yeah. And then, you know, her team got excited. Their parents got excited. And then before you knew it, like, I had all of these supporters. <laughs> and... It was, it was crazy. And they were embracing me in a way that I had never been embraced before. So people were really the people. The and people I, wanted you to be the yes, referee. Yes, and, and I loved it. <laughs> and, but, he, the, you know, the thing was, is I never thought I would actually become the, the referee. You know, I thought I'd take the test. Sure. I thought I'd fail. I thought I'd tell people, yeah. you know, look, <laughs> being a referee is not for me. The test was rigged. Some right, but I right, never right. thought that I would actually become a referee. Let, Steven, let me I, ask you an important question. Let me ask you, do you have any experience refereeing? No. <laughs> any experience with the playing field at all? Like, no, no, no. I'm the least, I'm the least qualified referee in youth <laughs> soccer history. I've never even, I've never even played soccer before. <laughs> and, you know, I've been a ref for the last few weeks now, and people are, people are losing their minds. And they're saying, he's breaking the rules, he's breaking the rules, he's breaking the rules. I don't know the rules. <laughs> I don't know what the rules are. But listen, you're the, you're, you're the referee. You're the referee, so anything you do is now the rule. I mean, by definition, if the referee does it, it's, it, it, it's referential. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I mean, so, pretty much. So when, now that you're in, do you feel like you're over your head? A little bit. <laughs> uh -huh. A little bit. I mean, <sighs> I can't win. The problem is I can't win in this situation because any call I make, one side goes nuts. And you should see some of these kids, they say some very, and the parents too, say some very mean things to me. Very mean <laughs> things. But you can't say anything back. I mean, the referee's well, no, got to stay you know, above I, all that I, stuff. I, look, you got to stay above all that stuff. I obviously. know that I should hmm, not say anything back. I should not respond. Right, that's but not. I can't help, I can't help myself. <laughs> well, what, take, well, what, well, what do you do? I'll, I'll take it home with me. And, I'll, and, you know, sometimes I'll just wake up at 3 o'clock in the morning. You don't. You don't. 
You tweeted the little girls? And people keep telling me that's not what a referee is supposed to do. Well, listen, have you talked to the previous referee? Well, it, it was interesting because from the sideline last year, I was very critical of him. <laughs> I said some tough, tough things. And yeah. it turns out after sitting down with him, whew, he's a great guy. <laughs> and I underestimated his job and how complicated it is. And look, the Middle Eastern section of the field alone <laughs> is a nightmare. Wow. Well, congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. What an achievement. What an achievement. What an achievement. Yeah. So do you have any thoughts on the election? <laughs> well, you know, I've actually learned a few things. Yeah. From this whole experience. Yeah. yeah. One, nobody wants to see me do a better job than me. Really, <laughs> that's true. And if by some chance I do do that, look, if I'm even a decent referee, mm -hmm. I tell you, I will immediately declare myself the greatest referee of all time, and you will <laughs> never hear the end of it. And I am so hoping that that's what happens. Well, good and luck. I, well, thank you. And I also think, you know, maybe if we were a little bit nicer to our referees, just a little bit, then more qualified people would want to be the referee. <laughs> and perhaps we would and perhaps we would be able to explain to our six and seven year old children why all the most important calls on the field are being made by Schmidt from New Girl. <laughs> You can see Max on New Girl, which airs Tuesdays on Fox and on a soccer field most weekends. Max Greenfield, everybody. We'll be right back.